I've always been of the opinion that nobody really wants to see who the best fighter in the world is. They just want to see good fights. And I want to be the one to put on the best fights in Freddy Combat. Oh! I want to be those fights that you can show your dad, you can show your granddad or your uncles, and you don't have to skip forward and look for the knockout at the end. You can watch the full thing from start to finish, and you're just going to be entertained. My career in Cardi Combat definitely hasn't been straightforward. I won my first three fights just in season three, went on to win the belt, and then from there it just seems to be a, a series of unfortunate events prohibiting me from being in the pick up for Marty. Beautiful. Oh, shoulders dislocated. Oh. The first fight you guys had, it was called on because of a broken hand. The second now, what appears to be a dislocated shoulder. Nobody wants to win by their opponent suffering an injury. Owen Chalmiak versus Jesus Lopez. This is a beautiful display of karate. It was hard for us to see who is the better guy. Oh. Most of the people, the commentators, Bass, Josh, GSP, thinks that Jesus won the fight. Jesus Lopez! We had an unfortunate situation. The commission had to overturn the result. The split decision was won by Owen. So Jesus is like super upset. As soon as we could, we set up the rematch, uh, which happens on April 1st. The co-main event, the rematch between Owen Chelmi and Jesus Lopez is not happening. Unfortunately, Jesus Lopez was medically unfit. He had to be taken to the hospital. When I was told that my previous fight against Jesus Lopez was canceled just hours before we were supposed to fight, it was incredibly frustrating, of course. There is the, the luck of the Irish, right? He has now three fights when it ended with some kind of injury or controversy. I'm just glad to be back in now. I'm always looking forward to the next event. I don't really look and dwell too much on what's already happened. There's nothing I can do about that. I just have to learn from it and use that experience going forward in my career. Yeah, I haven't been in the pit now for about six months, but best believe I've been turning my ass off. I've been putting in all the work I can, improving myself in every aspect. Just making myself into the best competitor, the best fighter I can. I mean, I'm constantly pushing boundaries. I'm constantly just trying to skill myself. A work in progress. I'm really looking forward to fighting the Dominican Republic in the amphitheater. I'm really looking forward to feeling that energy, whether it's hostile or whether it's supporting me. It just makes it all the better for me. It suits my style of fighting, which is just go forward, cause chaos, cause terror, break them up. Best believe I'm going to be as prepared as possible for September 16th. Thanks for watching, I'm Layla, and if you liked what you just saw, make sure you subscribe.